Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Guitar of the Day. I'm your host, Michael Lemo, and today it is Telly Tuesday. <laughs> but we don't have a telly today. And I knew you were like, well, how do they not have a telly? Norm just got back from the show. Well, the guitars will be arriving tomorrow. And I, apparently, there's like 60 or something. Yeah. He went wild. He said he wasn't, but he did anyway. <laughs> That's a good thing for everybody. We all get to see more guitars. Uh, what else we got today? We had a new uh, episode on our podcast with Alice and Freebo. Make sure you check that out. Um, that'll be exciting. And a lot of other guests keep coming every Tuesday, so it's really cool. I've even been listening to that Elliot Easton episode that'll be coming, and so much cool stuff. Can't get enough. All right, other than that, we got a really cool guitar. I came in today, and Norm said, you got to do this guitar today. I'm like, What? Well, let me tell you something. He knows how to pick them. He knows my style. So here we go. Uh-oh, tweet case, Jen. You might be here after hours. Because, you know. It takes you a yeah, while. Yeah, it takes me a bit. Okay. It's a 1959. What do, you, what do we think it is? It's a Fender Jazzmaster. <laughs> Whoa. That one's a crazy one. This one is one of the coolest I've ever played. So the Jazz Master was introduced in 1958 at NAMM. So this is the first full year of production of the Jazz Master. And it has an alder body. Um, this one is in pretty good condition. A little beat up, but it's a player in terms of it plays great. Um, but this is still a collector's piece. It's got that anodized guard. Um, and Fender switched from an anodized aluminum pickguard to a three-layer celluloid tortoise pickguard partway through 59. So this is earlier 59 because of that anodized guard. And it's crazy with the aluminum. I've never had, out of all the pickguards I've put on my personal Jazzmaster, never the anodized. And it's pretty cool. It's definitely a sign of a new guitar has arrived. Um, also, we have a maple neck on the back. Uh, no skunk straight, um, but you got your slab rosewood fingerboard. Frets are actually still original, but this one plays good. It, it actually plays great, I should say. Um, it's funny, they're kind of low, but it works for this guitar. Uh, you have your dot inlays, and then your two single coil soapbox pickups, my favorite. And then uh, you also have the three-way pickup selector with the amber switch tip. 25 and a half inch scale, floating tremolo system. Best in the biz, in my opinion, and this one is no exception. It plays so great. Um, you also have your rhythm circuit, which on this guitar slides easy. All the electronics are great. Two roll knobs, you got your volume, and your tone, same, so that works up here. And then this works when it's down here. Um, don't let this intimidate you guys. We get a lot of customers who are like, I'm thinking about the Jazzmaster, but I'm not sure because of this and the, all the knobs. They help and it's very easy to use and you find that you can do a lot of tricks like we've been over the bells which we'll cover today as well but what can I say? This is your guitar. It's my favorite guitar of all time. <laughs> and it's the first full year. Are you, are you excited? Yeah, I don't. I, we're not going to stop. We're going to stay. <laughs> I'm going to just keep talking about it. Bring the amp back. Bring the sleeping bag. Oh, sleeping I'm bag. sleeping back here with this chest master. All right, all, let's go. It's front. all yours if you want to buy it. I, <laughs> yeah, real flip it on me real fast. All right, let's go up front and see what it can do. I think it's going to do a lot. <laughs> all right, we're up front with the 1959 Fender Jazzmaster. Beautiful guitar. Uh, we're also going through the 1966 Fender Pro Reverb. All the cues at noon. Uh, starting off in an open G tuning, and we're going to start off with that rhythm circuit. Here we go.
Cool. Now we're going to neck pickup. Uh, all alone. Here we go. pickups or both pickups together middle position um, what do we get what do we get all right <laughs> Last but not least, we'll hear it in overdrive with the bridge pickup wide open. Here we go.
Cool, there you have it. Your 1959 Fender Jazzmaster, my favorite guitar of all time. And it's the first year, can you believe it? I'm playing one. Here at Norman's Rare Guitars. Uh, check us out on normansrareguitars.com and also on Instagram and Facebook. And check out, what? The podcast. The podcast. Okay, she's whispering at me and I can't tell. <laughs> check out our podcast. Uh, wh who's on today? Alice Howe. Alice Howe and Freebo. Very cool. All right, we'll see you guys tomorrow for a Wacky Wednesday. Thank you guys so much. Bye.